Right, Teleoto champs, and what do we have here? The Zeus Zenbook Flip. Flippy, flippy, flippy. And let's unbox it, have a look what it is. As you can see, there it is, a 13-inch 2-in-1. So this thing here is packed with the latest stuff in it. It is the UX363E. It says it's pine grey, 13.3-inch OLED. Wharf. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. OLED display, latest 11th generation Intel 1165G7. Has a 512 gig SSD, 16 gigabytes of LPDDR4X, so it should be the fast one, Wi-Fi 6, it may be Wi-Fi 6E, I'm not sure. Should have some Thunderbolts here, should be Evo certified, Windows Pro, that's good that it comes with Windows Pro. And if you want to upgrade your laptop to Windows 10 Pro, look in the description, I've got a discount code for you, you can also get Office 2019. Just check the description, use my discount code. And the last thing it says here is a 4-cell 67 watt-hour battery. Wow, wow, wow. So what that means is I can tell you straight off the bat that this is going to have good battery life because 67 watt-hour battery, full HD display, 11th gen CPU, the battery life is going to be amazing. It looks like it has some thunderbolts. So as I've said before, the rule here at Telio Tech is if it's new, Oh, that's not a knife. This is a knife. Yes, if it's new, I will unbox it. So let's unbox it. Oh, there you go. Look, I love how they present this stuff, okay? You open the box, it presents the laptop to you nicely there. I hope you can see that. That's pretty freaking cool and amazing how they do that. Look at that. Nice. Search for the incredible. I don't know if they found incredible yet, but um, yeah, they make some good laptops here. If we have a look here. We just have a quick look here. We can see there, 100% P3, awesome HDR 500, 70% less blue light, so that's good. But we'll have to check if it has PWM flickering. But it does say flick of three, so maybe it doesn't. What else you get in the box is look at that. You get a pen because it is a two in one. I mean, a lot of companies will charge this as an extra accessory. They give you the pen in the box because, indeed, of course, it is a two-in-one. We have some literature there, you know, standard fare there. And we should have a 65-watt USB-C charger, and indeed we do. It is a USB-C. We get the Australian plug there. But that's about it. I don't know what comes on this side. Whoa, actually, we got something. We've got a bit of a bonus here. Look. There you go, this is for your headphone jack. It has no headphone jack, obviously, then, because this is your headphone jack. It goes into the USB-C or Thunderbolt. And actually, I can see something else here. Look there, can you see? There's something hiding. And there it is. You get a nice leather pouch there. So, I don't know if it is real leather. It's probably fake leather, but yeah, that's cool. You get a pouch for your laptop. How cool is that? So, I'm always in two minds whether I should take this stuff off or not. Let's do it. Oh, there you go. That finishing on the lid. Oh, yes. Azus do that. The finishing on their metal is, it's just superb. It's absolutely superb. Hope you can see that finishing on there. Aluminium, of course, or aluminum, wherever you live there. And it looks nice, it looks nice, feels, yeah, feels like a normal 13 inch, I guess. And it doesn't look like it's 16 by 10, it looks 16 by 9. And the important thing, guys, is Evo certified, so this will have killer battery life. We already know that. You have the trackpad that can change into a number pad, that is awesome. Uh, Pantone certified OLED panel there. We have 496 pressure levels with that pen. 13.9 millimeters thick, 1.3 kilos, three-ish pound-ish there, something like that, perfect weight. AI noise cancelling, that is real, that is real, that is really good. 11 hours battery life, they're saying, and yeah, military this, military that certification, and it says easy charge, I don't know what that means, but it does look nice. Now, two-in-ones usually have the power buttons on the side, which we do. And this is the right hand side and we have the power button there and just the USB type A. And on the left hand side we have two Thunderbolt 4s. They have to be Thunderbolt 4 if it's Evo and HDMI out. I don't know what kind of HDMI that is. I suspect it'll be 2.0 or maybe even less than that. So let's try and start it. You know how they say don't work with children and animals? Well don't work with laptops because when you want power they never have them. 
Okay, so the first thing I can tell you is yes, the pen works well. Very good, nice and responsive. Two in one, baby. It looks good. The Wi-Fi signal is good because out here it's really hard to get Wi-Fi signal. I'm getting Wi-Fi signal, no problems. Same there, bring out the whiteboard because look at this. We're installing whiteboard because we have a pen. Now the display is a little bit glossy, but oh my God, OLED, wow, wow, wow. Let's have a look at the, you know, the brightness there. And you can see the viewing angles should be good and they do look good so on battery we want just that performance there on battery we don't need full performance on battery so yeah this thing looks good let's test out the old two-in-one features this keyboard should be disabled i've looked there it flips over and yep when you flip that over the keyboard is disabled at the back and yeah of course you can use it in all its modes you can use it in tablet mode like that of course now you can put it in the old tent mode like that and it rotates automatically two in ones i love it and look at that that's where the exhaust is the air there love how easy it is it feels feels solid there um yeah stay tuned for the review of this one it should be good it should have good battery life two in ones everything you want oled back on the 13 inches baby that's what we're talking about it looks like a good package i will say one other thing is this keyboard is nice because when i started typing with it it felt nice when i logged in and you know put all my details etc so yeah catch you in the next one guys tally ho